Adani's 3.5 gigawatt hour storage launch isn't just an engineering milestone. It's India's statement to the world. Adani just made its biggest bet yet on the future of clean energy. It's not solar or wind this time, it's storage. Yes, you heard that right, storage. The Adani Group has announced a 1126 megawatt slash 3530 megawatt hour battery energy storage system, BESS, at Khavda, Gujarat, India's largest and one of the world's biggest single site battery installations, over 700 massive battery containers, three hours of continuous power backup, commissioning by March 2026. So clearly, this is the missing link in India's renewable revolution. Kavada is already the world's largest renewable energy park and now it's well getting its brain. Adani's new battery energy storage system will store excess solar and wind power, releasing it back into the grid when India needs it most, which is during peak load hours and nighttime demand. It's actually what Gautam Adani calls the cornerstone of a renewable powered future, end quote. This system will make renewable energy reliable, round the clock and resilient, solving one of India's biggest energy challenges, intermittency. The capacity, it's 1126 megawatts slash 3530 uh, megawatt hour. The location, Khavda, Gujarat, the commissioning, by March 2026, best containers, 700 plus. The technology, well, it is advanced lithium ion batteries plus energy management systems. The extension, well, adds three hours of extra power capacity. The company plans to scale this to 15 gigawatt hour by 2027, add a staggering 50 gigawatt hour within five years, putting India in the same league as China and the United States in grid scale energy storage. So why is this so imperative? It's because energy storage is the glue that holds a renewable grid together. This best will do its best to do this, which is manage peak load pressures, reduce transmission congestion, prevent solar curtailment, improve grid reliability and stability. Clearly, it is about control. So for the first time, India can actually balance its renewable power like a modern digitized grid economy. We've already actually seen India's private sector go all in on clean technology from Ola's massive battery expansion, which we covered very recently on front page, to Reliance's Giga factories and Tata's lithium ventures. Adani entering the energy storage game marks a new phase where power generation and storage merge into well one ecosystem. And also make sure to check out our earlier deep dive on Ola's battery ecosystem because together these stories reveal how India is building the entire electric value chain from electric vehicles to grid scale storage. Now back to Adani. So by localizing large scale storage, Adani is effectively future proofing India's clean grid. It means fewer blackouts, smoother renewable integration and cheaper power during demand spikes. It's actually also a quite quiet signal to global investors that India's green transition is shifting from pilot projects to industrial scale. And here's actually what's next. If Kavra succeeds, expect a national battery grid where renewable energy isn't just generated, it's actually intelligently stored and traded. So, in conclusion, Adani's 3.5 gigawatt hour storage launch isn't just an engineering milestone. It's India's statement to the world. And here is that statement. We are done talking about green energy. We are actually building it. So from Ola batteries on the road to Adani batteries in the grid, India's electric future is charging faster than anyone expected. We would love to know what you think in the comments below. Thank you.